And we continue to track scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms on dual Doppler radar Viper 4D here at the 10 o'clock hour. And this one is severe. So let's zoom down on the radar scan and certainly that severe chance is with us throughout the overnight period. And the primary mode of severe weather tonight would be hail. We've had this huge hail core here. Let's zoom down even tighter on Doppler radar. You can see that severe thunderstorm warning polygon and around the pegs area and just to the east, we've seen a lot of hail with this system and certainly a lot of cloud to ground lightning. So we'll continue to see that isolated severe chance overnight tonight. And again, hail would be the primary threat. And of course, that lightning as well. We've seen a lot of lightning today. The severe storm in Oak Mulgee County earlier this evening. This sent in by our chaser Mark Fulta. He was live on the air tracking this huge supercell and it did produce golf ball sized hail to the east of Bristow and of course a lightning show as well. All right, so those current temperatures now Bristow 70 degrees, 75 in Oak Mulgee and 72 in Muskogee. The current temperature now at the Tulsa International Airport is into the upper 60s. The daytime high today before the arrival of the cold front was 82 degrees and the sunset tonight was just after 7 o'clock. The car and truck wash forecast tomorrow. I would suggest not doing so. Still more scattered showers in the forecast, but some great fall weather is on the way Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday before the next cold front rolls in. Tulsa State Fair, part of the Buffalo Run Casino and Resort Weather Camera Network. Of course, we had to shut down the midway earlier this evening because of that lightning thread, but it is open for business tonight for sure. On future track, clouds and precipitation. Overnight tonight, mainly mostly cloudy skies, still scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms. Again, some of those could be turning severe in throughout the overnight hours. Then for tomorrow on your Sunday, the continuation of mostly cloudy skies and still scattered showers and thunderstorms, not only for the morning, but also for the afternoon. Then we dry things out completely on Monday. The severe risk tomorrow is mainly in throughout northwest Arkansas and down in throughout the Poto area. Tonight's forecast eventually early tomorrow morning down into the upper 50s. Again, tonight's scattered thunderstorms, northerly winds between 5 and 15. That isolated severe chance, the severe mode tonight would be primarily hail, just like we're seeing now to the east of Pegs, and the storms might be producing a lot of lightning tomorrow behind the cold front only into the mid 60s northeasterly winds between 10 and 15 and look for those scattered showers your latest 10 day forecast what a change for those overnight lows by Monday morning into the mid 40s and then high temperatures into the lower 70s the next cold front comes in by Thursday and we could be around 40 degrees by early Saturday morning